Hi guys, Gerdy Verwoerd here, Dirk Waitley, Guide and Coach. This may be very well one of the last, or maybe the last, hike of the season. Um, later it is Sunday and the weather is supposed to change somewhere around Wednesday this week. Rain and snow has been forecast, so I thought I'd take the opportunity to do another hike and I almost I almost didn't go and when I went I almost gave up so the weather forecast for today was um, cloudy with a bit with sunshine but as I drove off from home all I could see was clouds there was not a blue patch of sky to be seen and then I, as I drove to uh, the starting point, the trailhead, I of course was stubborn and decided to take the old route, which is a road um, where you don't have to pay a toll. And even though it said, it told me that it was closed off after a certain point, oftentimes I know they tell you it's closed off, but you can get past it anyway. So I stubborn, pig-headed as I am, decided to drive up there anyways, only to find that uh, A, the weather wasn't clearing up, and B, the road was actually closed. So I couldn't get to the trailhead from that direction. So the only other opportunity I had to get to the specific trailhead that I wanted to go to was go back down and drive a long way around over a toll road. Now, it's I, yeah, I'm Dutch. Dutch are known to be cheap. And um, I don't really like paying toll when I don't really have to. But on this occasion I decided, oh well, well, you know, I'm... I told people I was going to hike, because, it, you know, it's just so that people know where I am. Or where they can find me if I don't come back. And... Um, so I decided to do... Well, you know, I was halfway there anyway, so... I decided to go and the weather still wasn't clearing up, it was still cloudy, it was still cold, it was windy. I got to the trailhead, it was still cold, it was still cloudy, it was still windy. Not ideal circumstances. And I picked a trail that um, was bound to get interesting, but before it got to be interesting I would have to hike along um, a road or sort of a road, which is not my favorite thing to do. So. By that time, I had already given up, almo almost given up, something like three times. But since it's the last, probably the last hiking day of the season, I decided to go anyways. And I, um, so I stepped on my backpack, gave myself an energy bar to, you know, to give me some <sighs> a boost and set off and now every now and again a tiny pinprick of blue sky was visible but it was still mostly cloudy and mostly cold and as I near the end of the valley I could see the clouds just coming over the uh, the pass I could feel the wind it was still cold and it wasn't really enticing and then all of a sudden all of a sudden the clouds broke open. I'll show you. Let me see. Uh, here we go. Yeah. Look at this. Look at this. I'll see if I can do an almost 360. So I'm on my way there somewhere. So I don't know if that's visible. Let me see if I can go a little bit further there. Oh, I have to go up. up way. Oh, of course. So I'm up one of those the the one on that side that's the summit that I want to go to and let me go oh, oh look at this I can go all the way around so um, that's the summit that I'm on my way to and I could for the longest time I couldn't see it and as far as I knew it was going to be cold up there it was going to be uh, misty cloudy I wouldn't be able to see I, I might not be able to find the trail and I might not be able to see anything. 
and then it's cl it just cleared up it just cleared up and it's the most beautiful day i love it when you can sort of see clouds come up and then disappear and sun peeking through it's i love that kind of weather so despite being hesitant uh, about the adventure that I was setting out on, about the hike that I was setting out on, it is turning out to be a beautiful one. Who would have thought? Now that happens in life with us, of course, as well. Sometimes we um, have in mind to set out on some kind of adventure, a project, um, a challenge, a task, and we know the reward might be um, terrific, we're not quite sure, but it might be. Um, but the thought of having to start or the thought of having to overcome certain obstacles keeps us from actually starting out. And those occasions when we do start out and we do um, overcome the obstacles. Not always, but oftentimes we find that first of all it wasn't as hard as we thought it would be and second it was totally worth it. So what are you procrastinating on? What are you postponing, putting off? What is the challenge that you are facing right now and uh, have been putting off for some time because you can see the obstacles or you can imagine the obstacles that are in front of you and you don't really relish the thought of having to bypass them, overcome them, whatever it is that you need to do to get to, um, to get the end result that you are looking for. Oh, anyways, that was what I was thinking about I was, as I was slugging my way through the valley along a road and um, hoping that the weather would clear up. That's it. That was, I just thought I'd share my thoughts with you and pose that question to you. So, as always, go there greatly and should you be hiking, be safe out there. Bye bye.